So there's another way to put this on the header of your website. And I want to show you what that better way is. I'll do that by turning off the background and just exporting this text. It's going to have the transparency because we're using a PNG and PNGs have what's called an alpha channel, which is why I've put the word alpha in front of the header here. So this is an alpha header, meaning it's a PNG with blank around the text. I'll go ahead and save that and replace it. And then we'll need the other half of this, which is the background. Now, this means that you'll be able to change the background and try different ones. I'm going to go ahead and export this again, just quick export as a PNG and I'll just make it um, BG. And I think this is my number 20. You can come up with whatever numbering system you like, but I'm going to use BG 20 there. In fact, let me export another background. Um, turn on just one of these down here so you can see how you can change it out. So here's another one, file, export, quick export, and this is number 17 for me. So let's go over to our website and remove this graphic because we're not going to upload it all together. Instead, we're going to change our header type here to have a banner. And that has this default picture here that we are then going to replace. So right here where it says image, we're going to upload the background. So let me do this BG 17, see what that looks like. And you can see that it just takes that up there. If we've got a large banner, it'll use a bigger part or a smaller part. Now we're going to add the graphic to this. So we're going to insert the image on top of it just the way we did before with insert images upload find that alpha header and then move it onto here and then we'll change its size make it bigger and find what works for us so you'll notice that the background and the text are separate but it now goes all the way across, which is one of the things I like about it. And if we were to decide to change this background image to something else, we can upload a different one and try our BG20, which is the original one that we had there. Now there is a little button here that has readability adjustment. If it detects that the text is hard to read, it might make it a little bit darker. And you can see that that's what it does, which is why we don't just upload our other one in here as our image. Let me show you what happens if you do that. If I upload the image that's already got the two things together and I remove the image that I put on there, you can see the whole thing is very dim, even if we take off the legibility adjustment sometimes. So this is another way to do that, but I really like it when we have control over what is on top of there.